This exam application tutorial is on the topic of digestion. The question for six marks is describe the roles of enzymes involved in the digestive system. This would be a really nice question to get because it's very easy and almost structures itself. So there are three types of enzymes in the digestive system. You just have to say what they do and where you'd find them, where they're active. So state three enzymes found in the digestive system, state where each enzyme is made, state where each enzyme is active, and describe which molecule each enzyme acts on and what products are made. So here are the three enzymes, amylase, proteases, and lipases. Amylase is an example of a carbohydrase, a carbohydrate digesting enzyme. You can see this table summarizes what they do. So amylase converts starch to glucose, proteases proteins to amino acids, and lipase fats to fatty acids and glycerol. And the reason they do that is to basically break down insoluble molecules, large insoluble molecules, ones which will not dissolve, into tiny soluble ones which will dissolve in the blood. So let's deal with one enzyme at a time. So amylase is made by the salivary gland, so that's where it's made, and it's also active in the mouth. However, it's also made in the pancreas, where it becomes active in the small intestine. So amylase is produced in two areas, the salivary glands and pancreas, but it becomes active in the mouth, where the salivary glands are, and the small intestine, which the pancreas feeds into. And amylase breaks down or helps break down starch into glucose. Those are the products that are made. So we're describing the molecule each enzyme acts on and the products that are made. Now, proteases, there are two types of proteases. You don't actually need to know them all, but it's worth remembering that pepsin is the one in the stomach. So proteases, e.g. pepsin, are made in the stomach where they are also active, as well as the pancreas, such as the enzyme trypsin, you don't actually need to know the name, where they are active in the small intestine. So just like amylase is made in the pancreas and becomes active in the small intestine, trypsin is also made by the pancreas and is active in the small intestine. Proteases help break down proteins into amino acids. And you can see that here, large protein molecule digested into smaller soluble amino acids. Finally, lipases, just think of liposuction, lipe to do with fats. Uh, lipases are made by the pancreas where they become active in the small intestine, just like trypsin, just like amylase. And lipases help break down lipids into fatty acids and glycerol, which you can see here. So you're just taking the template for one enzyme and applying it to other enzymes.